Okay, now we can key this shot. Return to the library. Select the Filters category. This is where those two filters we saw on the Clouds Generator came from. As you can see, there are a lot of filters here. I recommend you take some time to explore them all to get familiar with them. Your filter list may be different than mine because I have installed some third-party filters. For now, though, let's go straight to the keying category. There are four filters in here, but the only one we need is the keyer. Drag it onto the Rachel video clip layer. Wow! The green looks to have been completely removed, and there still seems to be very good hair detail. Play the clip. Then return the playhead back home. This keyer often does a great job without any adjustments, but let's get to know it a little better. While the HUD has a bunch of interesting controls, I prefer to work with this filter in the inspector because the inspector shows you all available parameters. So press F7 to close the HUD, then press F3 to go to the third sub-tab of the inspector, the Filters tab. 